The title of this video is very, very um, pretentious. But it gets the message true, so I'm like, yeah, all right, let's do it. Please forgive my drugged looking eyeball. And it's still red. I still don't know how it's how it's red, but it's gonna be red for the rest of the day, so you're enjoy that. So today's kind of gonna be an average day in my life. My life doesn't really have much routine, which is what I love about it. Today it's gonna be particularly adventurous. But I have a car lesson in around 20 minutes, so I really need to get curl in my hair. I can't do any makeup for now because my eye is clearly still um, irritated with me, so we're gonna go barefaced. Hold the maniac, my friend. Kiko, like, like last night, you don't come with us. No. Yes. We're in Daniel's Defender. It's pretty snazzy. It's snazzy. I don't even know if that's it. It's fine. Ta da! I don't know how much this thing costs. So today we're going to be going over to Gozo. It's the, the, the next door island to Malta. We're gonna go to some pretty cool destinations and because I have some clothes to photograph, because that's kind of what I do, um, we're going to check out some pretty places. Take some pictures. And we're gonna film it while we're doing it. Yep, that's, that's the plan. In here I have all the clothes that I have to photograph and there's quite a bit. Um, so it's going to be a pretty exciting day. So. Like I get people coming up to me and they're like, I saw you on Facebook. And I'm like, uh-huh. And they're like, why are you on Facebook? And I'm like, because that's what I do. Today I got sent a few items of clothing specifically to put on my social media and I'm gonna show you all the behind the scenes and the, the effort and the time and everything that goes into creating a social media influencer's worth of a picture. I'm going a bit extra today because we're going to an, another island but it's gonna be it's gonna be worth it you know I'm gonna take you with me and you're going to see what I did. That's a very happy Stella right there. Yeah. We're going to go here. Yeah. Then we're going up to here. This is where you got first. I want to try Ramla Bay. And that's where, that's where you get the main there. picture. We're gonna drive all on white roads here and get to this place. So what's that? Okay, so this video is already a bit confused mess because I'm apparently merging two days of my life into a video. <laughs> oh, don't kill me, please. Um, but basically, today I'm going to be continuing um, on yesterday's adventure. Basically, I'm going to be showing you guys what I actually do with the footage and the material that I got and the pictures and all that. 
But first, I want to actually explain to you what it is that I properly do. Let's have a sit down conversation, all right? I personally really, really like watching the lifestyles and different, different ways of living of other people. And so today I'm like, why not show you mine? I'm actually doing this video simply because whenever someone asks me what it is I do, on an everyday basis, I always have no idea what to say because it's usually misunderstood. I am a social media influencer. What that means, or digital influencer. What that means is generally this. I produce certain content on, in my case, three different social media platforms, either for myself or for other companies. That just makes me a YouTuber. It doesn't really make me an influencer. What does make me an influencer is this. Certain companies will reach out to me, will talk to me, will send me an email and be like, yo, girl, listen, we like your stuff. We like your, we like what you do and we would like to work with you. Um, and then they would be like, we've got a new campaign, a new project, we've got this new product. Can you please review it? Can you be a part of it? Can you, you know, showcase it and that is basically what social media influencing is i am influencing my followers with something to do something to try something out i would only promote things that i would personally use okay? i don't see that there is much point in influencing in promoting and advertising something that isn't something that you would personally be seen with it gets a bit trickier but i try to avoid as much as best I can to do something that I wouldn't like. So what yesterday, what I was showing you guys yesterday is a batch of clothing that I was given. My latest project, which I'm very happy about. Same deal, I get clothes, I photograph them. Promotion. So here is, for instance, all the things that I have to promote. I get sent a lot of things. This entire box is filled with products to, you know, advertise, but I need you. I'm taking you back. Haha, <laughs> the week. Beautiful. That's my life. And then today I'm going to continue editing uh, the pictures that I took yesterday as well as a video that I filmed today with this thing. <laughs> oh no. So I had to take off the wig. It was causing too much of a headache. Whatever. And now I'm going to show you what I actually do with the footage that I have on my laptop. But before that, I want to show you something. So I actually got more stuff. This is the wig. This is my previous wig, by the way. But I just have to take it off because baby, you hurt me. Um, and I got some new products. Um, so I got some new extensions from my baby. This, this is this is when it comes to extensions. Okay. When it comes to extensions, I absolutely love this. And they sent me another, another, another box of their besties. Oh my god, let me show you. I'm going to give you a sneak peek of what I'm going to be working with prior to working with them. This is so amazing. So now I'm probably going to be dyeing these and styling them in some ways. But basically, this is gonna be another video idea. So typically when it comes to editing and when it comes to footage and pictures and whatever, I try to leave at least a day in between just to give me kind of a break. Um, and that's what I did with this thing. Yesterday I took the footage. Yeah, I'm gonna be going in and reviewing it and seeing what actually came of it because I'm excited. I also have today's video to edit for tomorrow. So whenever I get to actually editing, the first thing I do is I always, always, always import them into photos so just because it gives me kind of an idea as to what I'm working with. Here is where we went. A lot of different pictures. Um, I actually didn't manage to capture any footage, but this is where we were. This is the cliffs in Gozo, where we were captured by the sunset. It was amazing. Now I'm actually gonna go through them and pick out which ones I like. And usually I just put them in this folder. It says to edit. I can actually delete all of these because this is what I already edited. Next, I use an app called Aperture, aperture. I'm gonna edit them. That's what I do. Oh yes. I'm just gonna go ahead and edit them and I'm gonna show you what the end result is. Okay, so I just stopped editing now. I even finished a bit of the video, but most probably I have to continue it tomorrow because it's getting pretty late and I need some sleep. But yeah, basically that is all. That is what I do. There's now 12 30 and i need to get some sleep because tomorrow it's the same thing <laughs> slightly different though it's always slightly different cool i hope you enjoyed this video 
and I will see you in my next video.